Ever from Maribel accused of hitting and killing a young man walking down an Knoxville sidewalk will face a grand jury. A Knox County judge says there is probable cause to believe driver Shannon Walker killed Ben Credich last month. 10 News reporter Krista Lucas is here to explain the case lawyers made in court today. Krista. Prosecutors focused on whether Shannon Walker was impaired when he hit Ben Credich and how did first responders know that? Walker's defense attorney focused on the kind of training first responders receive to detect if someone is drunk, on drugs, or both. The prosecution fired off one question after another to find out what happened that day. A witness who works at the nearby Beard and Kroger said he saw the whole thing. He started driving sporadically, and at one point he went on to oncoming traffic, about hit a car head on. The car swerved out of the way, and then shortly later uh, he went on to oncoming traffic again and then hit the pedestrian. The biggest question? Was Walker impaired? I do believe he was impaired. Uh, what he had taken, I couldn't specify specifically, but it did appear, uh, given to the symptoms, that it could be an opiate of some sort and maybe even combined with alcohol. Walker's attorney wanted to know what specific training first responders get to recognize an impaired driver. What's the most recent training you received on impaired driving? Uh, DUI instructor school, which was a 40 hour course in 2022. The judge said he thought the state had met its burden of proof. The state has prevailed in a lot of the cases to go on to the grand jury. What happens next is a group of citizens will meet behind closed doors. The prosecution will offer evidence of what happened, and it's up to the grand jury to decide if Walker should be indicted and face trial. Back to you. Crystal Lucas with an update in that case. And for now, Walker is in custody. His bond set at more than $40,000.